inna a'tainaka al-kawthar. We've given you the greatest, the most abundant good. Let me give you an example of how powerful this tongue is. How powerful these words are that we utter. We don't even realize what we say. This is why we do not know what we're on about. Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that on the night of Mi'raj, I saw an ocean. And this ocean was so big that only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows the limits of this ocean. And on the side of this ocean was an angel taking the form of a bird. And when a person says, Subhanallah, this angel moves from its place. When a person says, Alhamdulillah, the angel opens its wings. And the angel has 70,000 wings, and the angel opens 70,000 wings. When he says, Allah, wala ilaha illallah, this angel begins to fly. When he says, Allahu Akbar, the angel dives inside the ocean. And when he says, wala hawla wala quwwata illa billahi al-ali al the angel comes out of the water and it flaps its wings. 70,000 wings. From every wing, 70,000 drops of water fall. From every drop of water, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala creates one angel. From every drop of water, 70,000 drops of water, 70,000 wings. From every drop, Allah creates an angel and this angel glorifies the Almighty Allah and this angel keeps on asking Allah to forgive him right till the day of judgment. Yet it takes not even two seconds to say these words. When a person says La ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah, Allah has created a pillar next to the ash. And soon as a servant of Allah utters this word, this pillar begins to shake in front of the Almighty Allah. The Almighty Allah says to the pillar, Uskun, stay firm, do not move. The pillar says, Oh Allah, how can I stay firm when the sayer of this word has not been forgiven? Allah says, stay firm, now the sayer of this word has been forgiven. How long does it take to say, La ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah? We open these words at this moment in time and this pillar is shaken in front of the arsh of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. According to the hadith of Tabrani, Subhanallah wa bihamdi will not even take a second. Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, 124,000 deeds are written in his account. Subhanallah wa bihamdi and the angels have written. When a person says, La ilaha illallah wahdahu la sharika la. Ahadan samad, lam yalid, wa lam yulad, wa lam yakul lahu kufu wa nahad. It takes three, four seconds. And the angels, according to the hadith of Tabrani, Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has said that the angels have written two million deeds in his account. Two million deeds! Today you and I, we have no time for the small things in life. We're thinking about big things, big facile. Yet it will, it will be these things that will help us tomorrow on the day of Jesus.